Hello everyone, Chick here with another Transformers review, and today I'll be reviewing the Transformers Armada Red Alert and Long Arm. And there he is in his vehicle mode. Um, his batteries were dead when I got him. Fortunately, they didn't burst or leak, but my dad was fortunate enough to have some batteries I could use, so I put those in. So, pushing... Red Alert! So, uh, that's when you push it forward. Oh, if, assuming he's not in the, uh, long arm doesn't get in the way. Um, there's a gun, that's also for robot mode, which shoots out a claw-like missile. I'm just gonna, oops, I think, go back in here. It's, um, kinda, okay, make sure you're putting it in properly. There we are. And, well, why not, why not just leave it off for now? This, it, it's gonna go on him in robot mode anyway, so take that off, but it just goes in his hand. And then another thing that you can put long arm on is right here. Let's put him on, push that in, opens up this, and disc launcher. Launches out an orange uh, painted disc uh, with the cross on it and Autobot emblem. So that's, I guess, kind of cool. Very cheesy, very, um, you know, definitely gimmicky, extremely gimmicky. Our motto was all about gimmicks. Let's go ahead and close that back up. And then, of course, this is his Minicon long arm, who is pretty decent. Uh, definitely has a long arm. And he's definitely a little crane Minicon. And then, uh, pretty much to get him to robot mode, you just flip around his legs and there he is in robot mode that's it just rotate his legs and then he can move his arms that's pretty much it mini cons are very simple but also really fun in my opinion all right so to get him into his robot mode very very simple just kind of untab the sides Come on. or it's supposed to be simple but untab let's i guess flip open these doors then get this, hold it down, and get this latched into place, and pull this back. And this just kind of hangs back here. Then you just rotate his legs around at the knee, rotate, rotate his feet out, flip out heel spurs, rotate foot, flip out heel. Then his arms just rotate. One down, pull one down, and this is his uh, gun arm or uh, medical tool arm because you know he lost his hand in battle, I think, like a long time ago. And then just flip this back now and then rotate his head around, which is on a really weird point, if you ask me. Uh, and then let's see, his uh, his hand piece is in hidden in the door which you then plug into here and that's pretty much it to get him into his uh, robot mode i'd say uh his robot mode is actually pretty good uh for armada not the greatest but not the worst either uh definitely like it there's a uh, light piping back here it's not really working right now with the lighting, but you can kind of see what it's supposed to do. And then, of course, you can put uh, mini cons pretty much on any of the ports. There is another thing you can do with this leg, which is just very goofy, but I guess it's supposed to be a like gun type thing where you can put long arm right here and you can, I don't know, use this. But like I said, very goofy. But yeah, that's about it for um, most of what's going on here. Oh yeah, and then giving him his gun and this gun can also just swing over his shoulder but if i remember right in the show he would uh transform in robot mode long arm would go on the gun would flip out and he would reach back grab his gun and then you know start using it like a normal gun rather than a shoulder mounted one um all right so articulation head is not on a ball joint but it has a swivel you can look up and down, does not get wibbly wobbly. Uh, it is clear red plastic, so I am afraid that it could eventually break because clear tends to be a little more fragile. Arms can do a full 360. It can go out that far. Bicep rotation. 
over 90 degree bend at the elbow, but that is because of uh, transformation. There is no wrist swivel on this side, although I guess you could sp tw twist that if you really want to. There is no hip rotation. Legs can only go out that far. It looks like they're on giant ball joints that are screwed on from this side, but they can go out that far, forward that far, uh, back not too far because of his uh, backpack. And the knee, very limited bend there. And then you kind of have to rotate that with it. And then there is no ankle tiltage, but they are kind of slanted so that his feet are, legs are designed to be splayed apart a little bit. So yeah, he's pretty cool. Uh, there's some people I have kind of hated on him a little bit because, you know, he is kind of, but he does look like his character like he's supposed to. Uh, definitely going to be out of scale with most of the others as he is a bit bigger, but um, if Legacy makes a red alert for Armada, then it'll probably be a lot smaller, probably deluxe instead of this more Voyager class, so definitely going to be a lot bigger, or not bigger, smaller. But yeah, that's about it for Transformers Armada Red Alert, and if you liked this review and you'd like to see more, please click that like and subscribe button to see more. Till next time, have a good one everyone!